Hi everyone! On this video, I will show you how to connect Dodo MIDI to ICA Multimedia Sample Tank software sampler. Uh, now, to save some time, I already loaded Dodo MIDI and Sample Tank and Dodo MIDI second part. So, if you don't know how to set them up, uh, please watch uh, the quick start video and you'll see that part. So on this video we're just going to focus on configuring sample tank to work with Dodo MIDI. Okay, so here we have sample tank. I already loaded two sounds that we're going to experiment with and I already tweaked the sound of uh, these instruments just so it will be a nicer sound. But I didn't configure them to properly work with Dodo MIDI. That's what we're gonna do now. Okay, so the first uh, sound that we're gonna use is this Oriental synth. And one thing you should know is that in Sample Tank there are different versions of the samples and because of that the configuration is not always the same and that's why I'm going to show you two different sounds because in each one the configuration is slightly different and I'll show you how to do it for both of them alright so let's start with this oriental synth and um, what we're gonna do is click here to enter its options okay so here like in all the other demonstrations of Dodo MIDI you know that we need to change the pitch bend range to 24 semitones um, but in this version of the samples of sample tank you can't do that you can only change it up to 12 and that's not enough. The bend up and bend down or 12, that's not gonna be enough. So we're going to do that in a different way. We're going to remove all the pitch bend range to zero, both the bend up and the bend down. And now we're going to use uh, the modulation matrix to add the pitch range. One thing I should mention is that uh, sample tank has this uh, zone uh, part where you can choose different zones but in this uh, sound there is only one uh, zone this uh, sync sweep square so there's nothing here to choose uh, on, in the other sound we're gonna have two of them and you're going to see how that works soon all right so let's uh, configure the pitch band we're going to click matrix and here we're going to add a modulator so click here and then external pitch wheel now we need to tell it to control the pitch so we click here and then on a zone then pitch zone pitch now we tell it by how much to change so all the way up that's 12 semitones that's not enough but we have uh, this which doubles the amount so now it's 24 okay uh, let's hear it uh, before that I'll show you how it sounds without Dodo MIDI just the original recording just uh, some piece of music from soft cell it sounds like this with my singing <laughs> all right uh, let's hear it with dodo midi and sample tank with this oriental synth uh, sound <laughs> All right, let's hear it again. All right, uh, now we 
we're going to see what we're going to do with the other sound. So let's go back here. And so this is the Rianto synth. Now we're going to listen to this 3 5 drawbars organ. It's uh, just a, a Hammond organ. So we're going to mute this sound and turn this sound on. And again, we need to configure it. So click here so it will be selected. Then go to this editor. All right. Uh, this one is a little bit different. It doesn't have the pitch controls here. Uh, remember, like I said, uh, in sample tags have different versions of samples and each version is configured a little bit differently. But actually, this one is easier. We don't need to enter the modulation matrix because we have pitch band range here and we can change it all the way to 24. And then it's going to work. Let's listen to it. Let's listen again. And that's it. On this video I showed you how to use uh, Dodo MIDI to control sample tank. And watch the other videos to see how you can control uh, other samplers and synthesizers with Dodo MIDI. Thank you.